what's up my lovely bumberinas and bumberinos today we'll be testing out this little guy crow the dark inogami and yeah these are his stats like really low attack but he has really low base attack so 70% crit rate and 150 crit damage it's on violent broken set attack crit damage attack it's it should be fully skilled up yeah it's fully skilled up so what's so interesting about this guy first off he has the defense break like the other enigamis but he does additionally inflict uh, continuous damage for three turns which is nice and it's 80 percent chance for both of the debuffs then he has team up same as rogue the ally which will be team up with uh, will get his cool time reduced by one turn which is nice and this is the most interesting skill scar it takes on the enemy swans damage is increased by 50 percent if the enemy is under a harmful effect I think this is a little bit odd the translation uh, because the damage is increased for every debuff by 50 percent same as Akamamir and the fire um, what polar queen so yeah let's see how much damage Scar can do let's try to get as much debuffs as possible of course on Fireman Hell and let's get right into it guys okay guys now we have I think all the debuffs this team provides we have defense break we have a dot we have attack break glancing hit heal recovery and slow so six debuffs in total we have the attack buff hope we crit let's see the damage on scar 35,000 and it didn't crit what the fuck this can't be right did it crit I think there was no crit 35,000 no crit what the fuck I, I have to do it again guys sorry <laughs> I can't believe it okay finally we have all the debuffs we need we have this stun, which is additional, but I hope we crit this time. Let's see how much Scar can do when it crits. <laughs> 93,000. I think if we would have like one or two dots more, it would be 100k. Really nice, really nice. I'm really surprised. I didn't expect that much damage. Yeah, I think. I mean, sure. It needs a lot of setups and it's nothing for PvP, really. It's not worth it, but for boss monsters, I think 100k is really nice. Maybe not in Yeah, I think even in TOA you can use it. I mean, you work with debuffs all the way in TV, TOA, so why don't you bring him as a nuka? I think it will make your life easier. And he's dark attribute, so he won't glance. 93k damage. <laughs> really nice. I really like these dark nukas. Guys, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And yeah, stay tuned for more stuff. And <laughs> I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye.